Right, just hold on two ticks. I missed out something and I'm glad I've actually done it this way. Uh, basically all I've done is I've taken out the two mandibles and his jaw. Uh, yeah, I know it looks a bit crap right now, but you can kind of see how how the uh, jaw and the uh, two mandibles fit in there. Hang on, I don't think I've seen anybody do this on a review, so like I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna show you as best I can. So basically, all it is is that they fit in just inside there, and you you just need to give them all a wiggle, and they should fit in perfectly fine. But personally, on the whole. Uh, that just being as one piece that is just awesome and I really do like the way that they've done that so it makes it a whole lot easier to uh, fit in and they seem to be pretty stable as uh, three separate pieces so congrats Hot Toys on that so anyway moving on to the accessories and what it comes with and you will see why I've taken out the uh, the set and the uh, the jaw as well so moving on to the accessories you're probably thinking mm, that is not an awful lot I have to honestly say that you couldn't think of anything else that a predator could come with so I'm happy with the accessories um, because the reason why I say this is how how can I describe it? It's how heavy the figure is and how hench it looks and how big it is. So, okay, uh, a comparison to the eighty nine Batman um, that come with quite a lot, but however. That being a uh, DX figure, that's coming with a shitload of stuff. However, this is bulky as anything, and it is a heavy duty body. That is the only way I can describe it to you heavy duty. So, if I'm honest, with the amount of stuff that this has come with, I would say that it is more than appropriate. So, there's no complaints from me on that score so what do you get with it you get a uh, bio mask and a original I suppose a oops battle damaged version very uh, nice detail that's for sure look at that very well done indeed very well uh, done. Just a quick uh, look on the original one for you. Very well done. Nice uh, feel to it as well. So, what else do you get with it? You get um, four hands, six if you include the ones that's on him now. And i got to say, these are impressive hands. The nails are sharp, which is always good. So, you get... Uh, that's a kind of possibly open. So, two open. Uh, two closed fists, I suppose. Uh, and that's kind of, kind of a grabbing one, I guess. Yeah, and then the one that you have on him already are kind of an, a flat palm and a closed fist with his thumb sticking out, as you can see. So, that's it for the hands. Uh, you get two sets of mandibles, uh, the closed set is jaw and the open set as well now the jaw 
I would not really class as an accessory but the only reason why I've included these is purely and simply because this is what comes with it so come on it just felt right so uh, a pair of hand pegs always handy just in case the slightest thing goes wrong and you need to fix it uh, his wrist computer this is the one he came with wearing uh, two um, globe oh, what's the word uh, two Oh flip, I can't think of the word now. Um no it's not a hieroglyphic, it's um an illusion. Oh no, it's not an illusion. It's hieroglyphic, that's it, yeah. I think yeah, so two of them, uh two great pieces definitely. And of course you get this uh sheet thing as well which tells you how to put on things and how to accessorize him in every way there you go number two connect the mask no connect the wire from the mask to the socket yep So it's pretty handy. Oh, and there's the uh, wrist as well. The wrist computer. And of course, his. Well, it's more on the um, the computer itself and the uh, dreadlocks as well. Now I'm very impressed how they've done the dreads even though I haven't had a predator in the hand before but I'm really impressed and of course it tells you how to um oh no 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 those are holograms that's the word yeah, yeah. holograms um so it tells you how to um how to attach the holograms to the uh the computer itself so that's always good and then of course how you in, uh, how you do the light on his uh, mask the feature so oh and of course his uh, diorama base which is absolutely huge um, I did have it no I did have him on the base but it is a big piece and I will be getting a uh, a stand for him, just a typical uh, typical hot toy stand because it is just a big piece and more figures are on, well, no, but we'll be getting more soon, so, but it is a big piece, so, but if you have the room, definitely have it on uh, display as it gives the figure uh, just something oomph, so that's a definite uh, credit and it is really well done as well definitely that skull is amazing you've probably heard this loads of times by now but still it is really well done definitely really well done the uh, detail is absolutely is absolutely superb that's without a shadow of a doubt so that pretty much does it for the accessories at least and time for more posing with that bad boy and this is where the uh, real fun comes into it and I will tell you a little bit more about the uh, background story to this figure and why I uh, chose to get it. So now I've done the head and yes I have filmed this in separate pieces and I've done the uh, poses preferably before I've done the outfit and yeah you guys are gonna love them so just a uh, quick uh, glimpse and thoughts on the outfit I don't know absolutely everything on this guy so I'm just gonna go with it so from what I can tell his cannon his shoulder cannon absolutely awesome detail uh, let, yeah there we go check out that detail oh it's awesome his armor definitely 
very 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 well done I'll see if I can get in very close just to uh, give you guys some detail yeah look at that amazing amazing and the strap as well that is very well done his uh, kit on the side very very uh, very well done the detail on this guy is absolutely phenomenal and yes, I know I didn't uh, use amazing, but geez, I thought of a better word to actually try and put it like into words how how uh, detailed this guy really is. So overall, just amazing, uh, just amazing work for a first predator as well. I'm absolutely blown away. That's for damn sure. So um, the the body is covered with a netting um, you have his his uh, armor plates his belt as well his uh, groin I don't know the proper name for that but uh, his uh, groin armor groin groin um, yeah just awesome uh, details on absolutely everything uh, the just uh, the uh, knee pads the shin guards the sandals just absolutely mind-blowing because you would not get this on a human figure and this is what made me get this and it is just something so much different from a human figure because this is alien like and it is just absolutely guys it is just different very good different but she's i'm definitely getting some more preds what ones i may only get two more but seriously i'm not giving anything away so shit Jeez, impressed is not the word. So absolutely wicked job. Just a uh, side view there. His uh, armor. Absolutely everything. Yeah, look. Get a bit of a uh, need a bit of detail. See what I mean? There is just no faults to this guy. The dreads, very well done. And I'll see if I can get some detail on the dreads. See how close I can get. There we go, look at that. Amazingly done. The armour as well, jeez. Just, yes, definitely yes. If you guys have any doubts on getting a Predator, definitely get this for your first because this is just absolutely outstanding that's for sure